guys and gals out there, this is Rock and Rafi bringing you another edition of Rock and Rafi's Home Cooking. Ah, the scent of love is in the air, where you imagine a little baby cherub in diapers going around with a bow and arrow trying to find a victim to shoot that arrow of love to. No, it doesn't exist. But let me tell you what does exist. Imagine this, if you will. You make her an amazing meal, and she already knows what's coming right after. That's right, a bunch of red roses and a heart-shaped box filled with chocolate. How boring. Congratulations, dudes. You just hit yourself on the calendar of disappointment. But don't you worry, because Rockin' Rafi's got you covered. And in today's episode, we're going to dip, we're going to drizzle, and we're going to make gluten-free coconut macaroons. Hey guys, trust me out there, she's going to go coconuts for this recipe. If you're ready, I'm ready, it's time to go cuckoo nuts. Alright, preheat the oven to 325 degrees. Now in a large bowl, mix together one 14 ounce bag of sweetened flaked coconut, three fourths cup of condensed milk, one tablespoon of vanilla extract two tablespoons of coconut cream. Mix this well together and set it aside. In a separate bowl, using an electric mixer or using a wire whisk, beat together two egg whites and a quarter teaspoon of salt until stiff peaks form. Using a rubber spatula, fold the egg white mixture into the coconut. Put it in the oven and bake for 20 to 25 minutes or until golden brown. Go ahead and melt the chocolate in a microwave safe bowl, stirring every 30 seconds. Once the dark chocolate is ready, it should be nice and smooth. On some of the coconut macaroons, go ahead and dip from the bottom to the halfway mark of the coconut macaroon, while there are others, go ahead and drizzle with a fork. And here they are, the gluten-free coconut macaroons. Let's try one out. All I'm gonna say is, eat this till your heart's content. And why? Because it's gluten free. And men, make sure that you do make a second batch. At least she can have some as well. Guys, this is so easy to make, so simple to do. There should be no reason why you shouldn't make this. What else can you think of doing something a little bit different on that Valentine's Day? And if you haven't already, don't forget to like, subscribe, Comment down below, let me know your thoughts on what you like to do for Valentine's Day. Don't forget to share with your friends and family, and most importantly, that bell. Click on that bell so that you're notified when my next videos upload. And until next time, keep on loving!